This morning we have uh, spent time with a group of students from Vancouver Technical Secondary in East Vancouver um, with the goal to uh, ask questions about their uh, broader view on how the city um, is, how, the, how they exist within the city and what they see for the future for themselves living in this city as a way to inform the Vancouver um, planning effort, so the citywide planning effort. I think that what we've heard today from this group of students is deeply inspiring, the things that they're concerned about, whether it is um, um, equity, whether it's being able to see themselves reflected out there in the world, their uniqueness, who they are, uh, recognizing that different neighborhoods bring out different um, characteristics and where they value and see themselves in different neighborhoods. I think those things all matter, climate change, affordability, like all of these things have been discussed today and I really see that those are issues and concerns that they will have going forward and our opportunity is to look and see how would the citywide plan help solve for some of those concerns that you know these 16 17 year olds have right now but we heard when asked the question what overwhelms you when you think about your future financial stability was number one even if the second was uh, their community and where they live or uh, environmental issues climate change or financial stability was the same for all. So we recognize that A, these kids are aware of um, the pressing issues when it comes to affordability. I, I think it's too early to tell that this citywide plan would solve that directly, but I think it means we need to recognize that uh, when asked, one of the students was asked, um, space, living space over financial stability, they want financial stability and they see themselves living outside of their space to create community and connection versus everything happening inside the home. So I think that's quite informative when it comes um, to thinking about the citywide plan. Where you grow up and who you grow up with um, and like the culture that surrounds you and what you see like on the street mm -hmm. and inside your home too mm -hmm. um, and in your neighborhood, I think that's a big deal. For people of color, like for me specifically as I like, grow older, like, the fear of police officers become more and more real. So I feel like doing that, that connection not only will kind of ease my pain, but will also on the other side of things, like the police officers give them a better understanding of like all like minority groups. I think it's really great that um, the city wants to have input from the youth. It's nice to have our voices um, brought to the city and feel like um, our voices are actually making an impact. This is, Vancouver is a really special place and a place that I want to live for a long time and so having that input into our future and having that influence in our future it's um, really important I think definitely to me and I think especially for my peers as well. Honestly I would like it to be quite similar with the positives and just kind of lower some of the challenges, barriers that are faced by the people in the community.